Hey my love, so welcome back to another vlog. But before we get into this video today, I just wanted to go ahead and um, show you guys our sponsor for today's video, which is Rose Forever. So they did send me a box of roses that I got to pick out. Um, y'all will get to see which ones I picked out once I open up this box. Y'all, I'm so ecstatic about this. I've been wanting a box of roses for the longest. Like, y'all just don't understand how long I've been wanting this. So, I'm literally like this. I'm like more happy about this box of roses than like Christmas and my birthday and stuff. But yeah, I'm I'm probably being a little bit over dramatic, but I swear I've been wanting a box of roses for the longest time. So I'm just so thankful and I just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you to Rose Forever for sponsoring our video today and um collabing with me on this. I will have a discount code for you guys to get you a box of roses as well. Um, I'll probably leave it up on the screen below, but let's just go ahead and get into opening up this box. I'm so excited! Oh and I did pick out with roses I wanted. I feel like I'm gonna cry! And it's like, before I even open it up, y'all, it's like this velvet box material oh my god this just feels so expensive already like girl period y'all these real they smell good they smell like lotion i'm literally so oh my god i love this so much thank you thank you thank you to Rose Forever for sponsoring this video and sending me these. Um, I just have to find out where I want to showcase them now. I think that I may actually move this um, little lamp and this is probably going to take its spot. Yeah, that's cute. So, if y'all want to get you some roses, I'll have a discount code so y'all can get you, you know, some coins off of your flowers. But now we can hop back into the vlog.
morning. Good morning, y'all. So it is um the next day. It is Tuesday. Yesterday I went and got my nails done, as y'all can see. You guys back in the game with the long nails, period. I didn't talk to y'all at all yesterday after I went and got my nails done. Um so yeah, this is basically like me starting out the vlog and actually talking to y'all. So welcome back to another vlog. Subscribe to your channel if you haven't already. And y'all finna see me talking with these nails like until we go back short because baby, I've been waiting for this moment, okay? We got the long nails in there correct this time. Yeah, I remember I got them done for my birthday and that just was not it. But yeah, we're back in the game. Shout out to my girl Kayla. Period. So, um, right now, I actually need to, like, hurry up and talk to y'all because it's actually, I've been here. I was early for my appointment, and it's 8.02, and I decided to start talking to y'all right now. But, um, at my wax appointment, because I have a wax appointment today, an orthodontist appointment, and a, um, lash touch-up appointment today. So, yeah, we have a little bit, like, kind of a lot, and I also still need to get my toes done because I was going to do that yesterday, but I ended up not doing it yesterday. I don't know if that's going to happen today because by the time I get them, my lashes done, I'm probably going to be tired and not trying to do nothing. So, we're about to go ahead to this wax appointment and then um, I'll probably talk to y'all after my wax because I'm probably not going to really too tough um, filming there because, you know, I don't really like be filming like me when I'm actually getting my wax, you know. I just like will show the room, but I've showed the room like so many times. So, um, yeah, and it's probably, it's going to be super quick because y'all, it's nothing. I'm sorry, there might be too much information, but yeah, it's, it's going to be so quick. So, yeah, um, I'll talk to y'all whenever I come out of here. This wig been in my car for the longest. Like, girl, you're not gonna wear the wig properly, so you may as well just give it up. I need to go to the store and I need to buy me some more um hand sanitizer because baby Evan got me this hand sanitizer for uh what's it? She put this little hand sanitizer in my what's that Christmas? I think that was Christmas. And baby girl is gone. But I need to go get me some more for real, for real, because like this pollen out here, and when I be like eating or anything like that, I'm, um, I be needing to, I really just be needing to put this on my hand, period. Like, oh, it's the corona and pollen. I don't need no pollen. I put my hand in my face, and oh, child, because me and pollen, we don't get along at all. Like, baby. Me and Pollen like this, okay? Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, Y'all gonna be like, girl, now you was doing too much for them nails, but I'm sorry, I already told. I told my nail to, I told her, I was like, oh yeah, everybody finna get tired of me, cause. And I already been in my boyfriend's face like this. <laughs> he told some ain't nine, ain't nine. <laughs> But um, I just left out of my um, wax appointment. I told y'all I was gonna be super quick. So yeah, that was real quick. But right now I'm at Chick Fil A getting something to eat. <sighs> Hi. Hi. Uh huh. Okay, cool. So it's five sixty-eight. Thank you. Is that power record? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Have a great day. You too. You. But um, yes, yeah, so I'm gonna put, I'm gonna eat over here. You can go ahead, go. Let me hurry up and roll my window a little bit. I'm getting here. I wish I could have seen that because people just don't pay attention when they drive. You're not the only one driving. Alright, yeah, let me go over here. I'm finna pull right here and eat my food real quick. It's uh, cause my orthodontist appointment at like, uh, well, I'm gonna go over there at 11 and just sit there because I really don't have anything else to do until, I mean, like, you know. I might need to turn the other way because I don't like the way this look. Like it's making me look real red. Probably because of the 
the sun is right there. So I think I am gonna turn that way. I tell you, I don't like when the sun be on my face. Okay. Now, like I was saying, um, I just left my last appointment. Then I have an orthodontist appointment. I have a last touch up, like I was telling y'all. And um, my orthodontist appointment is at um, 11. Well, I'm going over there at 11. And I'm actually getting my colors changed today. Hold on, let me handle this real quick. <laughs> okay, there we go. So, anyways, let me, I finished. I had to see who that was, baby, on my phone. Let me eat this food. But, y'all, it's supposed to be raining, and I didn't even know nothing about that. So, I think I may actually need to go home and probably get some change shoes because I have my Ugg slides. And I just don't think that's a good idea because they're furry and they not like I kind of be breaking my ankles and knees but I know if y'all got some other size y'all know any of them like you breaking your ankles slick so I kind of go change because I know if I'm like in the rain or something I'm not gonna be able to run in this in these and these are my new ones that I had got for Valentine's Day if I can pick it up jeez these I don't want to mess them up so I recently I uploaded the vlog now this week I'm not uploading on Tuesday or Thursday yeah I know I usually upload on Tuesday Thursdays and Sundays or either like Thursday and Sunday I always upload on Sunday but this week I'm not uploading on either one of them days Um, I posted, anyway, what I'm saying, oh yeah, I always upload on Sunday, either way, like, you know, even if I miss one of those, I always try to make sure that I upload on Sunday, the vlogs, because that's the day that the vlogs go up, so, um, this week, I'm not uploading on, like, neither one of the, like, Tuesday, Thursday, but the vlog will be going up for this week, um, and just to the fact that I will not be filming, um, I wasn't, like, I'm not doing my hair on time to upload on Tuesday or Thursday, um, but I am gonna be filming a I'm gonna film this swimsuit haul like in I may do it in this vlog or I may do it as a separate video But I think I want to do it in the vlog because it's only five swimsuits and I feel like unless it's ten items or more It doesn't need a dedicated video, you know um, It's something that can be included into a haul. I mean into the vlog because I just feel like that's like uninteresting to watch five little pieces No, that's not it. So yeah, and then I also plan on filming the skincare routine this week and another video. So basically, the reason why no videos are going up this week is because I'm filming this week. I mean, I film every week, but it's just like I need to, um, I'm filming at a hotel if this happens. Because I don't know if I'm going to be able to, hopefully it's not booked the one that I want. But um, I'm filming it at a hotel. Because, like, y'all love the aesthetic and my uh, Get Ready With Me for Valentine's Day Hotel Edition. So, I'm going to film my skincare routine at a hotel. And, yeah, I just have a vision for how I want it to look. And it's just going to look so soothing and calm, like, spotlight. That's the vibe. So, yeah. Um, 
I will talk to y'all whenever I will talk to y'all when I get over here to my other my orthodontist appointment okay so I just finished getting my uh to oh, why is my voice sound so probably because I'm so sleepy y'all I'm so sleepy I had to take a Benadryl this morning because so much pollen out here and the pollen made make my throat itch like my allergies start messing up so I took a Benadryl this morning so I'm, I just been sleepy. I was sleepy last night because I took Benadryl last night. I just been too sleepy. But I went to my orthodontist appointment, as y'all can see. We got new colors. Um, I got baby blue, but this is the color that I had on them uh, when I first got my braces. But if y'all could tell, I got power chains. If y'all know what it is, <laughs> on the bottom, and then the regular ones on the top like the one by one because they added on my back bracket like on the two back teeth like all the way to the back because i didn't have those on and y'all can tell i don't have it on the bottom either but they added the two back ones up at the top so they gave me the regular ones at the top and then power chain still on the bottom um i don't know what this is supposed to be doing but yeah whatever i'm just ready to get them off at this point so now I'm about to, um, I have a last touch up appointment. It's 118. I thought that maybe my pedicure would take up a minute, but it really didn't take that long. Um, because I didn't have a wait, I went right in. So I thought that it would take a little minute, but my last appointment is at 2.30. And I mean, I really, I kind of want something to eat. I really just want a smoothie. I think I'm gonna go home get a change of um, some like different shoes and then that should take up that should be enough time to go last time I get home and then yeah it'll be time for me to head on to my last appointment probably and I should probably stop by my PO box because they said I had a package but I got white on my toes let me show y'all <sighs> Yeah, I got white on my toes this time. I really don't ever get like white, white. I don't know. I be feeling like. I be feeling like super white be like too. Like I feel like it don't be looking that good with my skin tone on my toes. Because my toes are kind of dark. But, um. Oh my god i'm so sleepy i'm like i just wanted to get in the bed and go to sleep i know when she i was like i know everybody probably like even in the orthodontist like i was barely even talking to the girl i know she probably thought like, i had an attitude or something but she was like just telling me this she was like okay we're gonna do passion da, 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 da. and i was like just not talking and then y'all know at the nail shop i usually be like i'm i'm kind of i talk a little bit like when i go to my appointments but this time like i was just so quiet like and then the man that used to do my nails because i know i be getting the sns and stuff i didn't i went up ended up going to the same nail shop <clears throat> <clears throat> i ended up going to the same nail shop i know i said i was going to find a new one but just since i already filmed me getting my nails done so i was just like you know it's cool i get my toes done that doesn't have to go in the vlog or whatever but um the man that uses does my nails you know i get the my natural nails with the sns and stuff he was like oh yeah long nails now long nails da, 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 da. i was like yeah and he just kept on looking at him then he got his wife you know they was talking in their language so i didn't know what they were saying but the wife came over there and she looked at my hand she picked up my hand and she just doing all this with my hand and stuff and i just I, i'm literally not saying anything every time they was just and then she walked away she came back over there picked my hand up again every time i'm just like like i'm so tired y'all I'm so tired. I just want to go to sleep right now. And then it's raining out here. That's not making it no better. Like this is weather for me to be in the bed and be asleep. But I have stuff to do this week. I, I'm not doing nails this week because I'm, I have stuff to film this week. So yeah, this is, I'm gonna have to go to the doctor and ask them to prescribe me something else for allergies. Cause I can't take Benadryl every day and it had me like this. Like I, this, this, I can't do it, you know? So I'm gonna head home real quick, get a change of shoes, and then um yeah, to go get my lashes touched up. And I'll probably talk to y'all whenever I'm done getting my lashes touched up. But you in a long cabin somewhere in Aspen. Girl ain't nothing to paint, ain't
tricking if you got it, what you asking for? Put you in a mansion somewhere in Wisconsin. Like I said, ain't nothing to the pain. We can change that last name. What's happening? Cause you look so good. Tell me why you wanna work here. I put you on the front page of a King magazine, but you gon' get yourself hurt here. Yeah. Hey y'all, okay so today is, what, Thursday? Leslie tucking in my ears up under the weed cap instead of having them like outside, but um, yeah, so today is, um, what is today? Today is Tuesday, and I'm currently at the shop. If I sound a little drowsy, it's because I kind of am, because I took a Benadryl this morning because of my allergies or whatever. I just had a client that I had to do. Um, but right now, I think we're about to go to Farm Bowls. Um, see, look, y'all. It's over my ear. Because it's, like, so tight. It's hurting my ears. But, yeah, I think we're about to go to Farm Bowls because I'm, like, really hungry. And I actually wanted some Farm Bowls, like, yesterday, but... I didn't end up getting any because I didn't feel like driving over there. But I also need to go over there and get some pads as well. Full work day. I feel I'm to get ready with me. Which, you know, the whole process of that takes like about nine hours. I guess you could say. Depending on if I prep my wig before the video. If I don't and I prep it like when I'm about to film. Then, yeah, it takes me like. Because I started filming at like 11. I didn't finish. Well, not nine hours. I'm tripping. 11, 12, 1, 2 three four six hours so um yeah that takes a while and then when I finished doing that I had to go out take pictures which I posted I'll probably insert a picture right here um came back home and I had to film a, I sh filmed a sh the um clothing a clothing haul why are my words acting like that one time I filmed the clothing haul and I also filmed the sponsor so yeah I had to film the sponsored portion of that video and then um I meant for this vlog I had to film that and then I'm still not done I actually have to film when I get home today so thankfully I only have one client so when I get home today it's back filming so yeah I'll probably talk to her whenever we get to farm bowl What it is. Oh, what's up? Can I just get some love? I'm uploading. Well, not uploading. The video is downloading. It was really supposed to go up at 6, but it had copyright with some in it, so I had to delete. I mean, re upload it. Because, yeah, we don't do no copyright, baby. I need all my coins, okay? <laughs> I went on to. I had to go on the computer because I had to work all day today. So, I mean, if I didn't have to work today, I would have been able to, like, upload it on time. But I had to work, so I didn't have time to, like, do everything. Um, and then last night, I was just waiting on the company to approve of the video first before I deleted this. Um, this one. So, um, now that I'm home, I had to go on to the actual, um, like, my YouTube studio and see, like, which portion of the video. Because it tells you which portion of the video is where the copyrighted um part is or whatever so i had to go see which part in the video it was that i needed to delete this is what stuff looks like if y'all were interested i'm gonna show y'all what it looks like when your video is copyrighted and I... okay so the video that i'm uploading is the day in the life nail tech influencer da, da, da. if y'all haven't watched that make sure you go watch that because this is gonna be up before but um Okay, so it says it's not, my channel isn't affected, whatever, like, so basically, it's not nothing where I'm going to get a strike or something like that. You know, it's just minor. Um, but right here, it says monetization is ineligible because there is copyrighted data in it or copyrighted whatever. Um, so here is the content or whatever it is in the video that is, um... 
has the copyright in it. And this is the little, you know, um, song. They be like, dun, 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 dun. what is it? They call it the, I think it's Playboy Cardi remix or something like that. But yeah, so I just went ahead and took that out and put in another song in the say right here. Video cannot be monetized. Or if I did want to, I could select this. Um, like I could trim out the segment where the copyrighted stuff is, replace it or mute it or dispute it if I feel like you know it's not a deal. But I feel like they, when you do stuff like that, it's like they have to take a minute to like. It take them a minute to like trim it out, mute it, dispute it, whatever it is, and I don't have time, so I would just rather just delete it and re-upload it. Um, so yeah, is. Thursday it's almost a weekend I need to fix my hair my hair looks like a total hot mess um yeah I need to fix my hair because I need to show y'all the stuff uh with this um like jumpsuit that one of my subscribers sent me it's super cute I actually needed one of these it's like a little new um jumpsuit so I'm gonna show y'all that and I also need to show y'all this pillowcase that another one of my subscribers sent to me both of them are like in nude colors, so I'm gonna show y'all those. But I don't think I've talked to y'all since like I don't know when it was, but it's almost the weekend, and I'm a little bit excited because it's Easter. The um jumpsuit that she sent me don't mind my appearance, but I just wanted to show y'all this. It's super cute. Y'all know this definitely my style, so a shout out to her for sending this. I'm gonna tell y'all who sent it. I mean, this was in the bag. So, her Instagram right here. So, y'all go shop. Get you a bodysuit. Okay. So, the other thing that ooh, I, I look like I'm sick by the chest that I was sent is this satin pillowcase in the champagne color, which I love. And they also put my name on it. see it they take orders um like they have a instagram and stuff it's called chance x moon this is what it's called so y'all go and check them out um she said sean we love your channel keep up the beautiful work we sent you a pillowcase with your name to keep you fly and cute that's true because i already use satin pillowcases because it's way better for your skin and stuff and your hair i mean i wear wigs so but as far as my skin satin is definitely better than the regular cotton stuff so um she also they also sent this her princess rose hydro mask um clarifying and toning it's y'all know me and my skin i don't i can't be testing that stuff because my skin is very 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 sensitive so this here i'll probably get to my mom because she she can she don't got sensitive skin as me but um yeah thank y'all for the pillowcase all that kind of good stuff <laughs> look they match it's like they sent it together Hey y'all, so it is Friday morning, almost to the weekend, baby girl, yes ma'am, y'all know that's our time, okay, and y'all know this weekend is um, Easter, but, so I have clients today, I have to go to work, I have to go to the shop, do a few clients today, um, hopefully it goes by pretty quick. This first one, I know she was getting some type of artistic type stuff. She always get artistic type stuff, she, little different stuff. Um, and then the rest of the day is going to be real smooth, easy. Um, so once I knock her out the way, it'll be smooth sailing, you know, basic sets, feelings, all that kind of good stuff. Um, so I'm real happy that the rest of the day is smooth. But, um, yeah, so when I get off, I probably I need to go to Walmart. And get some more aloe vera because I haven't had. I mean, I'm running out. Well, I'm like don't have any. I'm to the point where I'd be having to shake the bottle. Um, so I need some more aloe vera. I need to get um, some new razors and you know different stuff. I want to try this um, new body wash and 
a lotion from Shea Moisture, I think. Uh, it's supposed to like even out your skin tone and stuff because I have like discolor well not discoloration it's like my body is like in certain areas I have darker skin than the reds which is no problem but I just want everything to be even um it's about to be summertime I want to go to the beach I want to be you know just laid out whatever and then somebody just commented well she commented last night on my other video she was just like um I like how you post yourself without makeup um and show like your natural skin and stuff and i that i think i've talked about this talked about this before in like my vlogs and stuff but yeah most definitely if you watch my vlogs and not just like my get better means may, most of the time y'all are only seeing my natural skin i don't really i don't put on makeup for real for real i really haven't even been like putting on makeup lately to be honest because it's just like makeup I, I just don't like it. I'd be liking my natural face more. So, um, yeah, if I do, most of the time, if I have, like, a quick video to film or something, I may put, like, concealer up under my eyes, concealer on the little dot thing right here, on little, you know, spots that I may want to cover up. But these are um, starting to clear up a lot. So I'm pretty happy about that. And, you know, I was just, I responded back to her. And I was like, of course, because... I know a lot of girls watch me and I know I'm not the only one who may suffer from like acne or acne spots or whatever because I mean I don't really have like the bumps I don't really suffer from like the actual acne anymore well I don't know do you call it spots acne I don't know uh, right now I'm just in the process of like clearing up my dark spots my d discoloration um but I know that there's plenty of other girls out here suffering from that so of course I want people to know like it is okay like that is normal like it's life you do not have to always be looking perfect like nobody is perfect everybody's skin is not perfect and really you know i just feel like so many girls really do be like feeling a little bit down or have like low self-esteem or don't have confidence in themselves because of acne and girl you cute you if you cute you cute like acne or not it doesn't matter like I don't I don't know like that I feel like maybe like in high school and stuff like well when I first started getting acne yeah it probably bothered me because you know I was used to like you know normal skin like clear skin and then when I first started, I was like you know maybe it you know made me like I don't want this like hurry up get this off my face but as time went on and I see that like acne really does it's like a process to get it to clear up and you really have to just be patient and just you just have to be confident within yourself like period because acne if you do have it you know it's not easy like you have to it's like you have to try all these different things out everything don't work some stuff make it worse it's just like you know what girl I don't care listen it's gonna be there it's gonna be there if it go it go whatever but you know now i am i have been like i can say i've been pretty consistent for almost a year on my skincare routine i used to really play around like try different stuff it didn't work oh well you know just try i never stay consistent with a strict routine and actually try to test it out to see if it worked because if something didn't work in like three days i was like okay but this is like i could say for almost a good year probably like i started like last summer trying like being consistent and just being very strict on myself to make sure i wash my face in the morning and night do all my routine morning and night no matter if i'm tired or not i always am like no if you want your skin to look good you're gonna get up go wash your face um so that plays a part in it too you have to if you really want a change in your skin you just have to be strict on your routine and you know stay consistent it's all about consistency to be honest and sometimes it can be what you're eating because i know i watch my skin like all day like oh let me check and see if i got little little itty bitty bumps if i get itty bitty bumps after i just ate something i know that that's probably something that i need to stay away from um or you know if i just don't care that day i might go ahead and eat what i know is not good for my skin if i just don't care but if I if I know I don't need my skin to be looking crazy for a second, I'm gonna make sure that I don't eat the same things that I know is gonna make my skin flare up. And for most people, um, a common thing that does make your skin uh, break out sometimes is dairy. Like I, I noticed that like when I think I noticed that like in high school though. Every time I eat pizza, definitely gonna break out. That is not one of my friends um, on the skin side, but it's good. And that's kind of one of my favorite, pe I mean, one of my favorite foods. So I know if I eat pizza, 
I'm not trying to take no pictures. I'm not trying to be, um, I'm not trying to, you know, look good. Or, I mean, I know I look good, period, but it's not like, um, oh, I have this to film tomorrow. I have like, because I like my skin to be very smooth if um, I have like a get ready with me or up close type of video, just a sitting down video. But I know not to eat that if I know I have to film. But, um, yeah, so I just wanted to tell y'all that. And then I'll probably end up talking whenever I go get the little aloe vera and all that kind of good stuff later on. I will pick y'all up. I would say that I'll show y'all me doing nails, but that's already in the day in the life video. I just want to show y'all all the stuff that I um picked up or whatever. I don't know what has my neck. Like, whenever this right here is breaking out or, like, itching, that means I ate something that I wasn't supposed to eat. But um, I just want to show y'all everything I got. I went to Ross earlier, Target. And where is that? Uh, oh, Dollar General. Okay. So, I'm going to just show y'all everything I got. Starting out with Ross. So, first thing. Well, I was actually about to go check out when I seen this. This is a super cute little blazer. Like, I ain't never even much got no clothes out of Ross or none of them. But they do be having some nice stuff. Um, and I just seen this. I was like, oh my god, I've been wanting like blazers and stuff. And I seen this one. It's super cute. It was actually in the junior section. And it's a medium i think i wish it fit a little bigger like more oversized but it's fine and it was only 14.99 all right so y'all know yesterday the camera ended up um cutting off but i was about to show y'all everything that i got when i went to ross target and dollar general or whatever so first thing i'm gonna just start out with target i got from Target. I don't know why the camera keeps on going down and out. But from Target, I got a new um, razor. These are the razors I use. I used to have the purple one, but this time I got mint and gold. These are like really, really good. I love these, but I mean, I only use it for my underarms and my um, legs. So it's the Flamingo one. Um, and it comes with like, they have the different what do you call it? The blade things? The What do you call it? I don't know. The little thing. Like they have those. Excuse me. They have those in a pack. So like you can keep your razor. But like they have new heads for them. Like in a pack at Target. Um, and another thing I like about it. Is it comes with a shower holder. Like the little thing that you can stick up on your wall. And put it on there. So you know if you don't have anywhere. I know I like don't like really laying my razor down for real for real so that was a big help um so i will leave this link in the description box so y'all can go and get you one of these if you want um an extra from target i'm about to take this wig down and i'm gonna wear my natural hair for like um a week or two probably so i got this mia rosemary mint strengthening hair mask i don't know why my voice is sounding like this but um i've used miel products before actually i have one of their uh deep conditioners already and it smells really really good i can't remember which one it is but it's in the pink like it has the pink um packaging but this one says that it's also infused with biotin and encourages growth i mean i don't really need that but in the i was reading the um details and it said that it's for um it's a penetrative, it's a deeply moisturizing penetrative mask for dry, thirsty tresses. And my hair is really dry because I'm always wearing wigs, so it doesn't get the moisture that it needs. So I was just like, yeah, this is probably going to be perfect because, I mean, I hear good things about me, Yale, um, and I don't know, it just seemed like it would be good. And then the biotin and all that is just a plus, to be honest. I don't really need nothing for growth. Um, I, okay, wait, this is from Dollar General. Okay, so from Dollar General, I just got some new Eco Styler Gel. Y'all already know <laughs> about that. And I kind of got this from Target, but I went to Dollar General first. And I just got my OG products. This is the Renewing Arganol of Morocco Conditioner and Shampoo. I've been using these since, like, forever. These are my favorites. So, I had to pick these up because... 
they run out quick in this house okay um i have a few other ogx products um i think i have the keratin it's something else for like moisture um so yeah but i got these because i really like how th my hair looks when i leave this in like the conditioner in my hair um and i do leave conditioner in my hair even though it's not a leave-in conditioner i do it so yeah i also got some dove so y'all know what that is and then from ross this super cute blazer i think i did get to show y'all this one um before the camera cut off so this is just like a super cute i'm obsessed with this i actually just seen it as i was like about to leave so yeah super cute i wish that it was a little bit more oversized though because i like my blazers and like coats and stuff to be like a little bit more on the other side side but i mean it's fine i still don't even know how i'm gonna wear because it's not as big as i would want to wear with the outfit that i was gonna go for but i'll find a way it's from ross i had to pick up some more hangers these are the hangers that i use and um i feel like i've been getting a lot of new clothes lately because i literally have so many clothes over here from shein that i just ordered um and I have like a few pack other packages coming in. But I'm only just buying clothes because I needed like summer throw on clothes and stuff that I can like wear on the daily. Because most of the time when I shop, I be shopping for like pictures that, I mean clothes that I can put on for Instagram pictures and stuff. So I need clothes that I can wear on the regular, you know. So I've just been getting that type of stuff. We have these little hangers. These last, these last two things are... <laughs> yeah black of course so i have this jewelry tray hopefully y'all can see that it has a little holes in it and this was only 3.99 y'all so i was just like yeah i definitely need that because um i currently have like these little clear jewelry things but i don't like them i've had them since like i don't know probably since like eighth seventh eighth grade ninth grade or something like that so yeah um they don't go with my room anymore so I just got this because like I can just put it up somewhere. I don't even know where I'm going to put it. It doesn't even like, I don't even plan on having like where it's going to be seen. But still, I would just rather this than like the little hanging one. So I got that and a door rack because I needed a new door rack. Um, Kind of for my robes. But then again, at the same time, I probably will end up using this for my crossbody bags that don't um like sit along that don't sit along so yeah that's probably what i end up using this for i don't know but i really need like two of these but they only had this one um they had another black one but it was like a shiny black and it looked cheap so i like this one but this one was cheap and it was only it, this was only 5.99 so but it just looked better. It's like matte black. So yeah, that's everything that I got. Um, tomorrow is Easter. And I'm like really excited for Easter. I'm excited to watch church. Um, it was a challenge. Or he challenged us. Um, I watched Transformation Church. If y'all watch my videos, then y'all know that. I talk about him all the time. Pastor Mike. He's like so wonderful and amazing. Um, he challenged us. I don't really talk to that many people, but I don't even know how I ended up thinking about this. But listen, I have a whole bunch of subscribers and a lot of y'all watch my video. So if y'all see this tomorrow on Easter, if you're not out, um, hopefully, or I'm encouraging you to watch um, our church service for Easter. I'm pretty sure it's going to be so amazing. I literally love watching church, y'all. I want to go to Tulsa just to like get the real experience like in real life and not be watching it on youtube but yeah i encourage y'all to watch i think um it'll be on at 7 a.m 11 and 6 p.m i believe i believe it'll be on at that at those times uh live but he always like posted like it'll be posted to watch oh my god y'all i literally cannot wait so yeah if you're watching this video if you see this video after easter i still encourage you to go and check 
um transformation church out on youtube y'all literally a life changer ever since i started watching him um and i also like pastor sarah um robert jakes um if you like a woman or whatever but yeah i think that's gonna be all for this video y'all um in the next vlog i'll probably end up showing y'all this stuff that i got from shein and y'all will see me with my natural hair because I'm kind of tired of the wigs. Um, I just really want to wear my little bun to the back with my natural hair. And I just want to see, I just want to feel my scalp. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm, I'm over the wigs for a second. So, yeah, I'm going to close out this vlog right here. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. And if you haven't already, make sure that you subscribe to my channel. And I will see y'all in my next ones. Have a happy Sunday. And I hope that you had a wonderful, wonderful Easter. I will see y'all in my next video. Bye, my babies.